Hey, welcome back guys, General Tony here, coming back with a brand new Clash Royale episode. So about one hour ago, Supercell has just implemented the new update changes into Royale, and we now have to say farewell to the old Hog Rider, because they basically nerfed the card, and now we've got a new kind of Hog Rider. If I just pull up the information on the screen, the Hog Rider has had a damage decrease by 6%, so it's not massive. It's not massive, but they have changed him, and they've, they've kind of sucked the life out of him. So guys, if, if you're really sad about this just like me, go down below in that comment section and come in a hashtag RIP Hog Rider. J just come in hashtag RIP Hog Rider, guys. If we get 10,000 of those comments, then Supercell will bring the original Hog Rider back into the... No, I'm only joking. They won't really do that, but hopefully they can. Let's see if we can... Can we get that, guys? 10,000 people saying R.I.P. Hog Rider. So basically, what we're going to be doing right now inside of this episode, we are going to do double Hog Rider Mayhem. We want to test out what this new Hog Rider was like. So when I say double Hog Rider, guys, you better believe it. This is going to be the first time I've ever seen this, but we are going to mirror the Hog Rider. So we're not only going to mirror the Hog Rider, but of course, it is basically a new card, guys, because it's had its damage decreased. I don't think anyone has covered it yet on YouTube. So let's see what this new Hog Rider is all about with, of course, the mirror card. So the rest of the deck is Arrows, Goblins, Barbarians, Princess, Fire Spirits, and a Minion Horde. I'm not sure if that's the best deck, guys. The average Elixir cost is only 3.2, so it's extremely cheap. But we are going to go in for some live attacks right now inside of the Royal Arena. And by the way, for anyone that's wondering, we are closing in. We are so close to getting back into the Legendary Arena. Quick announcement, guys. For anyone that's new to the channel and has never seen it before, we've just started the 600,000 subscriber giveaway yesterday. So if you want the chance to win a load of gems, we are giving away $250 worth of gems. If you want the chance to win, guys, all you have to do is leave a like right now on this episode to show some support to the channel. Subscribe to this this channel right now to stay up to date with the giveaways and the winners there is a brand new raffle link which has just started guys the first link in the description box hit the link and click enter that is all you need to do so here we go we are back inside of the real arena mr Irwin 78 is going to be taking me on let's see what we can do against this guy so we got the double hog rider we got the nerfed hog rider and we've got the mirror card so he's chucked down an elixir collector straight away interesting interesting because he's going to be down on elixir and of course, we got the double Hog Rider coming up very shortly. So here we go, guys. Gonna send him one Hog Rider that side and one Hog Rider that side. Let's see what these double Hog Riders can do. Here we go. Both Hog Riders have made it through onto the towers. You know what? Let's drop some Goblins down on that side as well. Let's check that out. Damn. Double Hog Rider. Double Hog Rider. He gave me a well played as well. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So here we go, guys. He's got the Archers coming in on the right. Check it out. The Hog Rider on the right-hand side done a decent amount of damage. Fire Spirit's about to be dropped in now as well to take out these Archers. And there they go. So we got Mr. Hog Rider coming back up in one of the uh, the Knicks cards. And then I think the actual Mirror card is going to be behind that very shortly as well. So we go Oh, we're in trouble. Okay, we are in serious, serious trouble here. The Princess is going to need to do some damage to these three Musketeers. Here we go. Let's see if we can do it. We are in so much trouble right now, guys. We're going to have to drop down the arrow cards. We're going to have to see. Oh, there they go. There they go. Check it out, guys. We just annihilated his entire army. They just went down so quickly. So we got the princess still up and alive as well. That was hilarious. Damn, I played that well. So I just realized he did do quite a bit of damage to my tower though. But here we go. Double hog rider, guys. Check it out. We're going to chuck in the goblins as well. Should have gone in with the fire spirits. Actually, I knew I should have gone in with the fire spirits. The double hog riders have arrived onto the tower. And they get a couple of shots off. Not bad. We took it down to 268 hit points. Here we go. Fire spirits going to go in. And we've done not really too much damage to those barbarians there. I was kind of hoping for more damage to the barbarians. The princess is going to go down very shortly. There she goes, guys. We're going to drop down the melee goblins. I knew we were going to lose the tower. It's cool, though. Don't worry about it. Do not worry about it. We're actually in the lead, I believe, guys, because we've done a little bit of damage to his tower on the left-hand side as well. So here we go. Oh, no, 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 no. Not the three musketeers. Anything but the three musketeers. They're going to rip my towers into pieces. Damn. Okay, so Mr. Hog Rider arrived back on the right-hand side, but we're going to drop down the minion horde, guys. Onto the right. Hopefully, they're going to split up. Yes, they did. They split up perfectly. And we can uh, get that tower on the right-hand side down and do some damage to the Valkyrie. So, it's looking pretty damn good for us right about now. And we're going to send in the Barbarians into the center there. We're going to drop down the other uh, Hog Rider as well. Let's see if we can take out this Royal Giant before our tower goes down. Yes, we can. 
Hawk Rider's about to get one shot off. Yes, he got a shot off, so not too bad. We're going to go in with a second Hog Rider in a few seconds time, guys. Here we go. Second Hog Rider goes in. We're going to drop down the Minion Horde. Hog Rider pulls those Barbarians back into the center. He's dropped down the three Musketeers once again. He's taken out my Tower. So it is two, it is two Towers down each. This is going to be one very close game. Let's give him a little bit of a cry, guys. So we have to watch those three Musketeers. We could be in trouble if he drops them down consistently. Here we go. We're going to do the double Mealy Goblins. Because we need to take out that Royal Giant, guys. Can we take out the Valkyrie on his defensive side as well? There it goes. We're going to have to watch for these three Musketeers. I've got a feeling they're going to be coming in very, very shortly. Here we go. Going to drop down the Hog Rider. Going to go in with the uh, the Princess as well. Let's see if we can get some damage done to that tower. The Princess getting a couple of shots off. So is Mr. Hog Rider. Now we're actually going to drop the Barbarians down on my side. That was a smart move. That was a smart move to do. Here we go. We're going to drop down the... Uh, see if we can take out some of these cards here, guys. He's dropped in the arrow cards there. Let's see if we've got 13 seconds in overtime. Can we get the tower down? 13 seconds to go. I know he's got the three musketeers, guys. Can we get the tower down? It's up to 300 in points. There it goes. Yes, we got it. We got it. We got the win. We got the win. And that was that was damn close. That was close. And we got 25 trophies. Damn, that's going to be the most insane battle I've had so far. And we've just got ourselves a crown chest, guys. Let's see what's inside of here. So we got some gold. What's the final? A whole crowd. We got some hog riders, guys, and we got some skeletons, so not too bad. So, guys, I haven't done a gemming episode on this channel for quite some time now, and I'm thinking about doing the uh, maybe maybe 28,000 gems, so maybe $200 worth of gems for the, uh, I don't know, just, we, we, we hit 550,000 subscribers yesterday, so can I do that as a, can I do that episode as an excuse for that? Let me know. If you want to see me gem, guys, just comment down below, hashtag gem Tony. Just literally comment that down below. We'll buy uh, $200 worth of gems. Basically, I just want to upgrade some of my cards. Check it out. We can upgrade so many. So we're going to go in for a second live attack, guys. You know what? We're not even going to change up the battle deck. That was so intense. And uh, the Hog Rider, definitely you can notice the changes, guys. Although it's only 6%, but don't forget I was using the double Hog Rider. So we don't really have that much of a tank. But I think you can definitely notice the changes. So let's go in for a second live attack. So as I said, if you are new to the channel, do not forget if you want the chance to win yourself some gems, leave a like and subscribe to the channel to have a chance. So here we go. We're going to drop down the Barbarian straight away at the back right hand side. They're going to go off towards the right and we want to have the mirror card to come up pretty shortly. Let's go in with a princess here. Princess hopefully going to get a couple of shots off on those, uh, on those level 9 Barbarians before... He actually, uh, before he actually arrives at my Barbarian. So the Fire Spirit's going to take out their minions as well. And we've done a good job there. For some reason, his, oh, it was a Valkyrie. I didn't realize he had a Valkyrie there. So check it out, guys. Double Hog Rider going to go in on the left-hand side. Let's see what we can do. Two level 7 Hog Riders. He's probably seeing that and he's thinking, why is there two of them coming in? But they've arrived at the tower, guys. So it's looking decent. We're going to try and pull this, uh, this Prince into the center. We're in trouble here, though. The Fire Spirits took out my little, my little goblins there. So the prince has done some damage. Is it going to do another shot? Yes, it is. Just about took it out. It took me down to 1137 hit points, though. So we're going to use the fire spirits just ahead of the princess in case they drop down any minions. Hopefully, we can get a couple of shots off. One more shot. Nope, the Valkyrie got me. So we're going to go in with a minion horde, guys. Hopefully, take out the Valkyrie and the goblins before they get some shots off. So they got one or two shots off. Not too bad. Not too bad. So we got the hog rider ready to go. He's just used four elixir to take out my, uh, my minions there. So that's cool. We got the Hulk Rider. We got the Mirror Card. Let's see if we can do a little bit of a, a little bit of a play here. So you know what? We might send in the Barbarians on the right hand side, guys, before we do use the Double Hog Rider because I do want some form of protection. That is definitely what I wanted. You know what? Double Barbarians. Let's see if we can do it. Yes, we can. Double Barbarians. That was the correct choice. Otherwise, we would have definitely lost that tower there. So we've got the Double Barbs going in. We're gonna have to send in the Hog Rider in on the left hand side this time. Let's see if those Barbarians can do any damage. He's dropped in the Valkyrie, but they took it out pretty quickly. Let's go in with the, uh, the Hog Rider on the left-hand side. Check it out, guys. He's taken down the tower on his own. And the other uh, Fire Spirits just completely destroyed those, um, those, those minions there. Damn, that was good. That was a good play. That was definitely a good play. So here we go. We're going to drop in the, uh, the Barbarians once again. They got splash damage done to them by those Fire Spirits, but it's cool. We're going to go in with the Princess, the Barbarians, and, of course... 
the Hog Rider there. So he's just zap spelled my Hog Rider, which is cool. I don't really mind. We've got a tower down, so it's okay. We're going to go in with the, uh, the Minion Horde, which is going to take out the Valkyrie. He's probably going to fireball my Minion Horde. Yes, he is. There he goes. Oh, it missed, though. And here comes a second Minion Horde. So he's going to be in serious trouble here. We're also going to drop down some arrow cards to see if we can take out a Fire Spirit. Yeah, we're so close. So close. So 10 seconds left inside of the battle, guys. Can we get that second tower down? There goes the Hog Rider. There go the uh, the Goblins. One shot from Hog Rider. One more shot. We got it. Oh, so close. So, so close. So it was a great game, guys. And, of course, we got our second victory in a row using the, uh, the new and updated pretty much Hog Rider card. So... It's looking decent. So we are going to win the episode here, guys, because there is going to be a second one and possibly a third one because there is a there's, there's a lot to cover today, I'm not going to lie. And I definitely want to be using the new Expo and the new Mortar. I want to see what they're capable of doing, guys. So we will be doing maybe a little bit of trolling with them later on today. Don't forget to uh, let me know down below if you want to see me spend some gems for the 550,000 subscriber special. We'll spend maybe a couple of hundred dollars, guys, and upgrade some of these cards and possibly... Get to level 10 inside of the game. So I will see you shortly. Have a great Tuesday. Love you all. Thank you so much for the constant support, guys. Peace out.